John, within the Hexagon Manufacturing Intelligence platform and portfolio, you have the Leica Absolute Tracker that we're seeing here. Can you tell me a little bit about it? But before that, I do see versions uh, within very big and large manufacturing sectors, but also construction. Yeah, absolutely. That's, uh, that's uh, well observed. We do have within the Leica Geosystems business that Hexagon owns sort of two ranges of systems. So you might well have seen theodolites or total stations working outside, measuring bridges or roads and buildings, that kind of thing. So what we've actually done and what we do most of the time is take that technology from Geosystems, tweak it, uh, and make it applicable to the metrology side of the business. So what you can see here is the brand new Leica ATS 600. It's uh, absolute tracker, AT. S for scanning. So this particular tracker, the first tracker of its kind, has reflectorless capability. So we can use it just like a normal laser tracker, as you've described previously, to measure objects. We can also then just set it off on its own to scan a remote surface. So we can do a thousand points a second at a range of 60 meters, still with a really good accuracy. And that just allows the users to measure parts that might be inaccessible, uh, unsafe to reach, uh, and it's just super quick as well. So well, It's quite interesting actually, could be, uh, looking at the CMM behind us, uh, can it actually measure uh, different surfaces, so in other words, curves? Uh, yeah, absolutely. I mean, uh, we've got a very wide range or a gamut of surfaces that we can measure, so it doesn't really matter what shape the surface is. If the laser can see it, we can definitely measure it. Uh, we've got a very well-tuned laser, so we're getting good feedback uh, and signal intensity from dark and shiny surfaces, which traditionally in metrology are always tricky to measure. So, yeah, absolutely. And when you look at the sectors within our manufacturing uh, arenas, let's say, in the UK, but maybe worldwide, where does it actually fit in? Uh, that's another really good question. I mean, typically with Leica, they release an instrument and then maybe we discover where it really fits. So we've had a great deal of uh, good response and certainly the first few sales in the railway industry for a good example. So they're making very large uh, objects, railway carriages or vehicles as they're called. Uh, we've got a number of applications measuring the bogies, uh, measuring the carriages and even doing a safety check just to make sure that before they're released back onto the network, they're not going to clash with any of the, uh, the, the, the railway furniture in platforms and things like that. So really, when, when you look at the uh, other sectors like uh, sort of shipbuilding, marine maybe, but also, I, I suppose, a aircraft, I, I presume that's where this product is perfect for. Well, you've nailed it, yeah. We weren't quite sure where it would fit at the time of launch, but those are where the first few sales have been. Personally, uh, shipbuilding and the marine industry, absolutely. They find that uh, in the old days, they had to send guys up on a cherry picker with harnesses. Now, basically, they just point the laser at it. It's as simple as that. Whole aircraft measurement, absolutely, when we're checking for damage. So we don't need the microns that we normally chase with the tracker. We just need maybe one or two millimeters of accuracy. And this is certainly capable of that for things like hail damage and just making sure that replacement panels are fitting, that kind of thing. Well, the products are always good from uh, Hexagon Manufacturing Intelligence. But what, one thing which is exceptional is the software. Do you have new software with this? Uh, yeah, I mean, typically, again, with Leica, we've launched it at launch with full compatibility and checks to four of our traditional sort of favorite softwares. Some of those are Hexagon, some of those are non-Hexagon because we know that uh, users have a, a preference. We have recently launched another one, another software called Inspire. Um, if anybody's interested in seeing how that works, they can contact us. It's basically uh, an entry-level software that's got superb capabilities for point clouds. So. This ATS 600 generates quite large point clouds at 1,000 points a second, like I said. So, uh, yeah, check out Inspire if you want to see it. So, really, when you actually look at the system, obviously, most customers want a demo. So, I presume you're taking the, the actual uh, tracker and actually demonstrating with the customer, with the end product. Absolutely. That's what we always do. The large volume products uh, that, we, that we sell, specifically the Leica trackers, they're in the back of the van, we visit customers, it's battery powered, it's Wi-Fi, it's IP54, so we we're, we're absolutely love going on site, you know, I, I live for those kind of days. Uh, we, we can bring it on site and do the measurements. So finally, when you look at the portfolio uh, that Hexagon Manufacturing Intelligence actually offers, this fits in quite nicely in a, in a very, very extreme sort of area, doesn't it? We have found that it's, it's going to sit rather nicely in the range, absolutely, yes.